Hey guys, it's Beth, and today I'm back with another project share from my Pine Street Square pad that I'm working through. And this time I did some ornaments. A while back, I don't know, sometime within the last year I'd say, at Michael's, I had found a bunch of MDF like ornament type pieces that were on clearance. So they were originally $2, it says, and I want to say I paid less than 57 cent, 50 cents each, so not bad. I got a bunch of different shapes. There's some tags. I got at least one tree, some mason jar shaped ones. So just kind of a, a variety of shapes. I kind of grabbed whatever they had left. And so I decided that I would try and use these and make some ornaments using the paper from my pad. So I started with this tree one and basically just turned it upside down, traced it onto my paper, like the back side of my paper, cut it out by hand, and then used Mod Podge to glue it down. And then I sanded down, trimmed up the edges where it needed it, and then, you know, coated it with Mod Podge. And then I couldn't figure out what I wanted to do with it. I don't know if I want to use vinyl and like put a message on here of some sort, like some vinyl words, or if I want to do an embellishment. I don't know. I haven't figured out what direction to go with it now that I have it. I have the paper on it. So if you have suggestions on this one, let me know. I'd love to hear it. And then the other ones I did, I used the tags and I took some of the scraps of paper that I had from the, there was a plaid, cool plaid pattern in this pad, took some of the scraps that I had and just cut, used my silhouette to cut out some letters, the J and the Y. And then I had gotten these, they're like wooden shapes, like wooden embellishments, and it came in a variety pack from Hobby Lobby, I think, last year after Christmas. I think I managed to snag them on clearance. And so I decided to use these as the O for my joy. So I thought they turned out really cute. I just used some epoxy to glue those down. I still need to go in and kind of clean up my glue a little bit, but wanted to share these before they went to our next craft show. So just something different that I tried. I like how those turned out. And like I said, I'm still trying to figure out what to do on this one. So let me know your thoughts on that. But if you have any questions on anything, let me know. Otherwise, thank you guys for your time today and hope you're having a crafty week.